shot in the head, is that correct? Uh, at this time, I knew there was gunshots. It's still early in the investigation and everything's ongoing. What's so the relation you. between the, the man and the child? Uh, that is actually still uh, determined. They're both at the hospital. Uh, this is very, very early stages of the investigation and that's pretty much all I have for you guys. What time too. was this at? Uh, sorry, that was at uh, 2.30 uh, p.m. Lieutenant, can you give me a sense of the investigation? Looks like there's two crime scenes. You're here at 25th and Capitol, and then over at 24th place as well. Are they related? Uh, there was uh, driven with a vehicle, so there's there's some glass, and we're just, again, still trying to piece everything together. Um, we'll have more for you. Was there an argument with the man who got shot with somebody else? That is still, again, everything's ongoing. It's still very early in this investigation, so that's, that's, the, that's the brief. Uh, the ambulance ended up taking him to uh, the hospital. So the man so did, not did not drive, drive. the girl to the hospital? Uh, somewhere there was an exchange that someone drove, uh, helped them drive to one of the hospitals, and then from there an ambulance was called, taking him to a different hospital. So, but thank you guys very much. Thank you. Thank you. Let's bring you up to speed on uh, the breaking news, what the Milwaukee police lieutenant was just talking about in that live press conference, or the press conference that we carried live. Before 2.30 this afternoon, a 29-year-old Milwaukee man and an 11-year-old girl not related were in the area of 25th and Capitol, and they were both shot. Apparently, that 29-year-old had an altercation with another male. And uh, the good news is, we're told the injuries are non-life-threatening. They're being treated at a local hospital, while police are now working in this area to found the, find the person who did the shooting. We'll bring you more information on this coming up on the top of Live at 5. Still ahead.